A woman's clothing reflects her upbringing by her father, the honor, Gyra, of her brother, the manliness of her husband, her desire to follow her mother's example, and, above all, her awareness that Allah is always watching. That's why they said to Maryam, O sister of Harun, your father was not a wicked man, nor was your mother unchaste. They reminded her of her brother, father, and mother. When these figures are upright, she is likely to be the same. A pious person once said, Revealing clothes on a woman is a sign of Allah's displeasure, just as he stripped the clothes of Adam and Hawa, A.S., when he was angry with them. A young girl said, When I see a girl revealing herself, I think of her parents and remember the verse, Stop them, indeed they will be questioned. Quran. This increases my modesty, so my mother will not be questioned. Interestingly, most things prohibited in this world will be allowed in heaven, like wine, but one thing that remains forbidden both here and there is nakedness. In fact, one of heaven's great blessings is to be fully covered. Allah says, you will not be hungry therein, nor will you be unclothed, Quran. Such a powerful reminder about the beauty of modesty.